welcome to all of our viewers from around the world. We have quite a game in prospect here, just waiting for the players to emerge, and we will be underway. And here we have Portugal against Austria. This is Peter Drury, and I'm happy to inform you that Jim Beglin has joined me to offer his expertise. Well, thank you very much, Mr Drury, and hello to everyone. A moment for pride and reflection as players and supporters stand for the national anthems. Rises for the national anthem of Portugal. for this game. Away we go then. Jean Moutinho. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Jean Moutinho. It's Jean Moutinho! Oh, he's really drilled it. Strong punch. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Nani. Karnik looks to slip it through. No, that's not the ball he wanted. Jean Moutinho. Ricardo Carvalho. It's Manny. Harnik. Jean Moutinho. Cristiano Ronaldo. Looks like a good ball through. So what now? Tries a through ball. Immediate danger. And it's Harnik. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Cristiano Ronaldo. Alaba. It's come 
loose. And it's Charisma. Nani unable to make it happen for all his good intentions. Well, a little short of forward momentum, lacking thrust. Down Bartlinger. Portugal putting their opponents under a lot of pressure in the early stages. William Carvalho. Charisma is a clever pass. It's a move that looked promising, but uh, eventually thwarted without doing any harm. Austria going about it patiently, perhaps too patiently. Fiorina with a good steal, well played. William Carvalho. Cristiano Ronaldo, now the pass. Harnik. Tries to stroke it through. First quarter of an hour gone. The other side yet able to force a breakthrough here. Gian Moutinho. Nani. Alaba gets into a dangerous position. Well positioned to make that interception. Gian Moutinho boots it upfield. Now it's Nani. Nautovic tries the route one option, gets into some space. Is it in? Fair effort, he reacted well. Alaba made such a clever run there while everyone was focused on whether the cross was going to come in or not. And I think his running from a deeper position could yet pay off. Well, he would surely have scored there more times than not. Resma, Nani, and it's Charisma. Done very well to intervene. Fuchs, Arnautovic, Ricardo Carvalho. Gian Moutinho. Nani. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. We sit high. And the finish! This could fall anywhere. Bam Bucklinger gets good distance on it. Harnik. Forceful run down the right, but he's short of options now. It's a good-looking cross. And that's been repelled. Now the ball's come loose, and the chase is on. Alaba pushes it out wide. Harnik passes it through. Arnautovic. And it's the goalkeeper's to claim. Gian Moutinho. Harnik is the guilty party there. Nah, 
Mane. Managed to get it away. Good run, ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. Arnautovic locks it towards the front. Looking to force his way through. Well, that was a really awkward one for the goalkeeper to deal with. Jean Moutinho. Mani. Good spell of possession, this, but very little to show for it. Looks to thread it through. It'll be a corner. But when he struck that, he must have thought it was going in. Such are the margins of success and failure in this game. That was so close. Tries a through ball. And on Nautovic! Good delivery, but no joy. Yeah, and it all came from very good trickery in the, in the wider position, but quite a static defence was pretty fortunate to survive that little episode. It should have been much worse. Ricardo Carvalho. Jean Moutinho. Arnautovic. And the ball through. It's a decent ball. You felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Portugal get it back again. Charisma. Fiorina. Charisma. Nani. Fiorina. Nani. Cristiano Ronaldo. Now the pass. Entertaining game this. Both teams have had chances, but it's still nil-nil. Fuchs plays it into the channel. Charisma. Wide to the right, out towards the flank. Harnik. The defence can get it clear. And the counter is on. And it's Charisma. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Looks like a good ball through. And the assistant referee rightly gives him offside. To the final five minutes of the first half. Arnautovic tries a long pass towards the front. Jean Moutinho. 
Nani. Jean Moutinho. Cristiano Ronaldo. Jean Moutinho. Arnautovic. Well, that's where he wants it. And he's made certain that won't get through. Looks to slip it through. Now, surely. Taken short and the cutback. Manny! Marvellous goal! Well, let me assure you that scoring just before half time is always a real treat. And when it's one of your top talents who delivers it, it just seems to fuel confidence that little bit more. Quite exquisite, brilliantly dispatched. Look, you can end up looking a bit silly if you don't make the right connection on the volley, but he met that cross perfectly. Portugal draw first blood here. And yeah, they may have got the lead, but that next goal now is absolutely crucial to the complexion of this one. Fiorina have scored near to half time to give them a 1-0 lead. Jean Moutinho. Goes long. the half-time whistle well that certainly pleased the fans and the players are definitely happy with that scoreline the question is now can they protect it Portugal the happier of the teams heading in for half-time 1-0 up of the second half Portugal carry a one goal lead into the second half Jean Moutinho and it's Nani Jean Moutinho decent hit and on target Arnautovic, Fuchs, who's going to make this theirs? Charisma, it's a long forward pass. Jean Moutinho, and it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Passes it 
through. Flags up. Pepe. Nani. Fiorina. Caresma. Now it's Caresma. Nani. Now it's Fiorina. It's Cristiano Ronaldo! Oh, another save. Caresma <laughs> plays it short. Back out it comes. And it's Chao Moutinho. Good clearance now, can they make something of it? Lobs it in gently. Shade too heavy, keeper could pick that up. Arnautovic. Cristiano Ronaldo. Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. Viorinha positions himself well and cuts it out. Austria can't seem to retain possession. And it's Alaba. Yeah, the defence had him exactly where they wanted him there. Didn't even give him the space or, or the room to turn. And I think if they can keep him facing the other way, then his threat becomes a much lesser issue. Portugal are ahead here by what is still the only goal. Alaba. Big chance. Hefty challenge, but fair enough. It's Cristiano Ronaldo. Decent progress down the left. That's not going to make it. Alaba plays it out to the flank. It's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Jean Moutinho. That's Cristiano Ronaldo. Nani. Balls loose. Who's getting there? And it's Nani. Tries a through ball. Harnik. Harnik with the cross. In for a header! Loose ball, who's going to get that? Oh, just needed a better contact. And it all came from very good trickery in the, in the wider position, but quite a static defence was pretty fortunate to survive that little episode. It should have been much worse. Another piece of really good defending. Keeper's got good distance on that. Fine defending there. Alaba. Hooks out to the wing. Now here's the through ball. Arnautovic. Can he deliver? Fiorina. Nani. Tries to get it forward quickly. Portugal. Get dipped into their subs. Alaba. Another piece of really good defending. 
it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Austria emerge unscathed, they were right up against it. Fuchs comes forwards. Promising move that, good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. Aimed long and direct. Dinks one in. Keeper's ball. Harnick. Now the pass. Harnick looking to run onto it. On oh, Neltovic! It's there! Well, that's something that will make the manager proud because they dug in deep then and they've got their level up. Well, the cross was inch perfect and the header unerring. Well, look, it's, it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle. But that was beautifully met, it really was. Portugal have a sub ready to come on. Mario. Pepe. João Mario. Good idea, just poorly executed. Virinha. João Mario. Nani. Cristiano Ronaldo. It's a loose ball. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. It upfield. He's away. Ricardo Carvalho. Spoon forward. Looks like a good ball through. Played out wide. Altovic tries a through ball. Pepe, Gianmutinho, forward it goes. Gianmutinho is alert to the possibilities, but in the end, it's fruitless. Forward quickly. Jao Mario. Chip through. Nani. Rules loose. Who's getting there? And it's another assault on goal. Cristiano Ronaldo floats one over. And another time. Portugal, and they 
get themselves in front! Time and space are plenty, he was never going to miss. I think when you can see the goal like that, the manager has to start questioning his personnel because to allow someone into that position, totally unmarked, I think that's reckless in the extreme, I really do. to go with all this possession now the pass Rui Patricio catches it safely Fiorina João Mario aim forward that'll be a throw Arnautovic will try cutting inside here. Ball swung in. That's a case of crossing in hope, and unless they provide some more options, it'll be more missed than hit. Lofted into the middle. Jean Moutinho. Into the last five minutes. Unbelievable. Time minutes, and we're all square again. That's wonderfully done. Crisp hit, true finish. Look, volleys can be worked on and improvements can be made, but in the moment, it takes timing and balance to catch the perfect spot on the ball to produce brilliance like that. That is absolutely magnificent. He's made it two, and no doubt he's hungry for more. All square again into the dying minutes. Cristiano Ronaldo. João Moutinho. Portugal have to get it into the box and quickly. That's a poor 
kick by the keeper, he's just given it straight back. I think they need to be more direct now and just start getting the ball forward. Now it's Harnick. Ah, that was just asking too much of his teammates by playing it in so early. Michel Moutinho. Passes it through. Harnick shoots! And he's there to hoof it away. Great build-up. It all deserved a better ending. I think there's always that danger that the defence can get exploited in that way. That must have served as a real wake-up call to them. Rafa Silva. Cristiano Ronaldo. There is the final whistle. Passion and panache and perseverance and, in the end, parity. A really good game to watch. How do you look back on the game then, Jim? Look, a draw shows a level of industry from both sides here. On that alone, I think it's been quite an interesting encounter, actually. And that's where we have to end it. From me, Peter Drury, and my co-commentator, Jim Beglin, a very good evening to you all.